Okay, so here we are uh, inside Miriam, um, just going for a little test drive around the block, uh, just to, we're fully charged at the moment, so I just need to run that down, see what it looks like after a short drive round, just test things like the power steering, the brakes, the acceleration. Uh, so here we go, ready to go. We are on, ignition is switched, we're on forwards, let's release that handbrake. Comparison is um, uh, Indy can get something like 80 horsepower. Um, uh, this can get about 107. Uh, and there's no kind of gear ratios to mess with on this one because you just got single speed. So I'm, I can my my left hand is purely for moving the indicator and waving at pedestrians of which I probably won't find on these country roads. So doing little drives like this also helped me to remember um, anything I may have forgotten, such as hooking up the speedo cable. <laughs> so I'm looking down at my speed and seeing, oh, I've obviously forgotten just to reach around and screw that back on again, um, which is nice and simple. Actually, let's go for a bit of a longer drive, shall we? Still between 90 and 100%. Oh, there's a Porsche here. Should we catch him up? I've had a few people come up to me, um, literally while I've been out and about, and I haven't been out much, just every now and then pop into town to do a few jobs, um, and I'll do that as part of a test, so I'll take a camper out um, just to, and run some tests as I go, just to keep everything running smoothly. Um, and yeah, in the last, I think almost every time I've gone out, I've parked up and someone's come over and said, oh, are these the electric ones? So there's obviously, people being aware of what we're doing. I'm loving this steering wheel. You can probably just see the edges of it. A cracking idea. Because it was all battered and a bit worn. You can buy a new steering wheel, but there. Uh, you got such an array of choices and it's a decent steering wheel, it was just battered. So just some and a badminton wrap land quite nicely, roll it round, does a great job. Test that horn. Perfect. Flick into reverse. It's that simple. Cameras come on, on the Alpine system, so I've got a really great view of what's going on behind.
roll her back into her space. That camera is great. We should put them on everything. Everything we own, everything in the world. Power steering is doing its job. Perfection. There we go. So thanks so much for watching. Um, yeah, we're really proud of this conversion uh, and it's due to go back to the customer very, very soon. So I'm trying to get some videos done uh, before that happens so we can um, get it compromised, get it back to the customer um, and, but you know, kind of really like it and really enjoy it um, to get those final things finished off. Um, if you've enjoyed this video, we would love it if you could share it on um, your socials, if you could like it and subscribe it, if you're uh, watching this on YouTube. Uh, yeah, it'd be really great to spread the word. And also if you're interested in an electric camper conversion, um, there's all sorts of stuff that we're trialing in 2020. Uh, really exciting stuff to get a lot more of these classic vehicles uh, converted to electric. Uh, so make sure you get in touch um, and see maybe if we could do something for you and your camper. And if you're curious about the next camper, there she is. Catch you later.